New at 10 on KGUN 9, when it comes to filming big motion pictures, Arizona often gets overlooked. Since 2010, the state has stopped offering tax incentives to production companies. But just last month, sponsors of two House bills introduced hope to bring that money back into Arizona's economy. Despite losing out to big movies, like Tucson has attracted a lot of smaller projects in recent years, like independent films and television shows. Nine in your sides, Ricky Mitchell caught up with one local filmmaker who's getting ready to release her movie called called Lucky You Ranch. Yes, that's right, Guy. Lucky You Ranch was filmed entirely in Arizona, the majority actually in Saurita. Now, they didn't have a big Hollywood budget, of course, so the film's executive producer and writer says she hopes to see those big blockbusters coming back to our state. Here we go. Quiet, please. We're rolling. It's a coming-of-age story. A young boy bullied in school and even contemplating suicide. Then he meets a girl. She changes his life. Jinya Desmond is the executive producer of Lucky You Ranch, currently in post-production and will soon screen locally. Desmond has lived in Tucson for decades, so it was an easy choice to pick the old Pueblo. But since big production companies don't have the same ties, Desmond hopes the state legislature will bring back incentives. It's counterintuitive why they don't just say yes, yes, yes. Arizona is one of 11 states that don't offer tax incentives to production companies, and that's now the number one factor in choosing a location. And they'll actually rewrite the script to fit into an incentivized state. Shelley Hall is the director of the Tucson Film Office and says last year Tucson brought in 11 million dollars from films, TV shows and commercials. We could be doing 10 times that. Now one of those house bills HB 2621 addresses the tax incentives directly. The other bill HB 2144 actually proposes to reopen the state film office that closed in 2010. Now the Tucson film office is more optimistic about that second bill and think it will be a good first step in bringing the movie business back to Arizona. Guy Stella. Thank you so much, Ricky. Well